This instructional video is to demonstrate how to mix Vercon properly. Vercon is a broad spectrum disinfectant that has been widely tested in a variety of agricultural applications. To get the most efficient use of the product, a simple process needs to be followed for a complete mixture. Vercon's efficiency comes from the powder dissolving into water, which sets off a chain reaction producing the fresh brine of super activated disinfecting molecules. This mixture will cycle until all the active ingredients is used up. In normal circumstances, this will last about one week. This is why we recommend mixing what is needed at the time. Vercon comes in many formats, 10 kilogram, five kilogram, 500 gram, and our newest form, tablets. Each of these containers comes with an appropriate measuring device for its size. The tablets are self-dissolving on immediate contact with water. One tablet is rated to make 500 milliliters of solution at the label rate of 1%. Simply drop one tablet into 500 milliliters of fresh water. Make sure to leave the lid loose while dissolving to let the working solution develop. This format is great for disinfecting hand tools, boots, and small areas. For the remainder of the size, the volumes may vary. Vedoquinol wants you to get the most efficient and effective use out of our products and has developed a calculator to help you determine how much product you will need to disinfect the desired area. This calculator can be found at the Vedoquinol Biosecurity website. Additionally, on this website, you will find a guided brain shark on how to use the calculator and finally, contact information for more personal help. If you are using a diluting applicator device, the calculator also can help you concentrate the Vercon mixture to the right level with the input of the working ratio, making the result of the application hitting the surface at the proper 1%. If you're not sure how to measure the working ratio, please visit our website and there you'll find an instructional video on calibration. Once determining how much product is needed, we continue with the mixture. First, fill the water in your mixing pail according to the chart. It is best to use tepid water for easy dissolving. Second, measure the amount of Vercon needed. Even though Vercon is known to be an environmentally safe product, at this point, we suggest you use your personal protective equipment in case the powder is spilt or aerosoled. You might note that the measuring devices are all in milliliters, yet Vercon is a powder and is measured in grams. At this point, Vercon's weight and volume are the same. Thus, one gram is equal to one milliliter. The next few steps are more critical as you increase the percentage in the stock solution for diluting applicator device. Add the Vercon to the water. Stir the Vercon gently to ensure all the powder is exposed to the water. Leave the solution sit for a few minutes to let the water dissolve the powder. After a few minutes, stir the mixture to help the remaining product dissolve. This product is now ready to use. This process is fairly simple, but it's common for many people to miss a few steps and the Vercon is incompletely reacted. Some of the issues we see if you're aggressively stirring the particles when you just put the Vercon in, the particles do not have enough time to dissolve and float unused in the mixture, making the Vercon less effective. This unused product will settle to the bottom and eventually be left as sediment. Also with aggressive mixing, bubbling action will increase, developing a huge amount of foam on top of the liquid. In this foam, there could be specks of the active Vercon ingredients caught in the air bubbles. Again, making it not as efficient as a proper mixture. Vedicronal wants you to get the most efficient and effective use of our products, and hopefully this video will give you another step in better control. Vedicronal is always available to offer individual personal help if needed. Feel free to contact us from the information on the Vedicronal Biosecurity website.